Dallas Joyce liked the stream. Hey, what's up, Dallas? Hey, Jackie, how's it going? Today we are going to build the Hoonigan. It's called the Hoonicorn. Jackie Mustang. Sue Stewart shared your stream. Thank you for the share. Appreciate that, Jackie. Jackie Sue Stewart liked the stream. And the like. Michael Hill liked the stream. Hey, thanks for the like, Michael. Oh, you got everything out of your old place today. That's good. Rich already tossed Russell in jail. <laughs> Give you a walk around. This is uh, the Hoonicorn Mustang. Kind of doing this today as a tribute to uh, Ken Block. Looks like uh, Russell's been uh, following me for 398 days. I bought this car uh, at an auction, at a salvage auction, so it needs quite a bit of work. But I have driven it. It does run. It's badass. Yeah, unfortunately he did. I mean, it was unfortunate that it was live on stream. But that's all I'm going to say about that. It happened. And that's it. So anyway, taking you for a look around it. Let's see if we can open the hood here. Looks like we got to take it off to open it. So why don't we go wash it first and see what we're working with? I drove it, but I haven't even washed it off. I don't know if this is all just dirt or if it actually has a paint job under it. Michael's been following for 49 days. Oh, hey, there is paint underneath it. Damn, it looks good, too. That's cool. Looks quite a bit better, doesn't it? Toby Stroud liked the stream. Hey, what's going on, Toby? Wow, it looks quite a bit better inside since Toby we watched Stroud it. Toby Stroud shared your stream. Thank you for the share. Let's start her up here. Oops, that's not what I wanted to do here.
but it'll be a lot better after I fix it up. Not that great of a drifter, apparently. <laughs> about this car is it's uh, 1400 horsepower all-wheel drive if you're drifting it's usually an accident <laughs> right This thing looks pretty good for being a salvage car. You see there's several things missing. It's got a it's got the livery up on the hood on one from one car and livery on the body from another. Yeah, I mean, you go to the salvage, you generally get a pretty complete car. They're not they're not usually drivable. Well, um, yeah, they'll be missing oil or something to where you can't start it and be missing a few body panels, but be mostly a complete car. Whereas you go to the junkyard, you might get a shell and that's it. Let's see, while we're while we're in the wash bay, we might as well do the interior. Oh yeah, that looks better. All right, so now put it in the shop. Let's do a diagnostic on it and see what all needs to be done to it. Does look like it's in pretty decent shape. Seventy and eighty percent, so that's not bad. Bought a salvage and went from there, yeah. That's the way to do it. too far away from it. So gonna start it again here.
yeah, the idea is to fix them up and sell them, make a profit. Although this car, just by washing it, I'm probably into a profit. Oops, that's not what I wanted to do. So all I've done wash is washed it, and I've gained about two thousand dollars because I was about six grand in the hole from its sell value right now. I don't know if I'll make a lot, but there's there's plenty of stuff to do to it. Let's see here, what do we got as far as the engine? I know, right? I probably would have paid a lot more for it. Yeah, see, the body is where most of the work needs to be done to it. It's in fairly decent shape mechanically, it looks like. Well, this is another one I have set aside to build. But I ran across this one and I was like, now nah, we got to do this one first. best way to go about this is just start tearing it down. Uh, although before I do that, I need to look at my inventory and get rid of stuff that's below 100%. Make sure there's nothing in here that I want to keep just in case. Let's tear down. <laughs> yeah, right. All right. So everything we got left is in really good shape. So now we can go back. Hey, how's it going, Larry? Melissa Torres liked the stream. Hey, Melissa, thank you for the like. Hey, hey, Heg. <laughs> Larry Coyle liked the stream. Thanks for the like, Larry. Let's see, what do we got here? Oh, yeah, that's right. This is all-wheel drive. Got to start there. Russell Brock liked the stream. What's going on, Russell? Thank you for the like, brother. I 
sometimes the controller is better, sometimes the the mouse is better. Alan Rice liked the stream. Hey, what's up, Alan? Welcome in. Thank you for the like. Bill Cook liked the stream. Hey, what's up, Bill? Welcome in. Thanks for the like, brother. Streamlabs seems to be way behind. <laughs> Getting all these notification things after uh, said hello. <laughs> oh, yeah. Chuck. Thirty second delay, yeah. Laney win like the stream. Hey Laney, what's up? Thank you for the like, appreciate that. Thank you for the like, Laney. Appreciate that. I think I may have already said that. But... the tick tiktok stuff going on I, I missed that comment let's see your mod bag for who for us or me did you turn it on because i know you have to you have to turn it on
I was gonna say, both of you should have one. Messing with all platforms? Shouldn't have anything to do with Facebook, though. Oh, we are missing a differential. Looks like. How the hell were we driving without a diff? I don't understand that one. Yeah, he's doing all right. He's uh, he's awake, but he's hungover. Yeah, as to be expected. Hey, there you go. There's the badge. Isaac Martinez liked the stream. Hey Isaac, welcome in. Thank you for the like. Appreciate that. for the day by nine o'clock. <laughs> That's weird. Still show suspension parts up here. This is a complicated car though, so not surprising. Logan Halkett liked the stream. Hey, Logan, thank you for the like. Body says 9 o'clock and it's late enough. Yeah, me too. Well, that's right. we got to take the gearbox out before we can take the engine out. So... Should be able to pull the engine out as an assembly. Don't think we got to take the exhaust manifolds off. Perfect. 
Fried eggs and bacon for breakfast. Fried chicken for dinner. Call this a colon cleanse? Yep. Add sausage and eggs for breakfast. I'm gonna have a steak for dinner too. Woke up at 8 and then fell back asleep for a bit. <laughs> Shit, I, I meant to drain it. Okay, well. Mikdad da Iwala liked the stream. Hey, thanks for the like, Mikdad. Oh, I know why, because the car's not near. 89 degrees outside. Holy shit. Wayne Fussell liked the stream. Hey, what's going on, Wayne? <laughs> McDad Da Iwala shared your stream. Hey, thanks for the share. Appreciate that. It's not windy and golden, but it's, I think it's still 60 here. All right, now. The car back down, grab the engine out of it. Oh, that's weird. <laughs> Left the turbos there, even though I took the engine out. Yeah, it is a little different, but... Toxic Gaming since 2020 liked the stream. Hey, thank you for the like, I appreciate that. Oh. 
guess these shocks up here are not removable. Ken PMDR liked the stream. This is the Hoonicorn Mustang that uh, Ken Block drove for Hoonigan. So all-wheel drive, something like 1,400 horsepower. It's crazy. Missed the beginning of the stream. I went and drifted it around a little bit before I, uh, before I started tearing it down. Is this one I bought at the auction, so it was actually a running car. What's up, Ken? Alright. Guess we start up here. Up on the other side. There we go. All right, Toby, thanks for hanging out. Appreciate that. Enjoy your dinner.
Oh, yeah. Thanks for that hashtag, man. Appreciate that. Yeah, Ken was a hell of a driver. I enjoyed watching him do his thing. Followed him into rally racing, yeah. I think he was only forty nine. Oh, did she really? I hadn't seen that. Are you getting ready for WrestleMania? I've seen that, uh, what you sent me earlier. That's pretty messed up. <laughs> Surprised that didn't cause a problem in between the two.
See, that's body. We need parts. Can't even repair a clutch. That's pretty cool. It's gonna save me a lot of money.
All righty. Now, I want to paint the block because it's a Ford, so that engine should be blue. Is red though. Ah, damn it. That's not what I wanted to do. Didn't want it white. four calipers on this car. Mess the pan here. I want to keep those.
Oh, the heck's the pan? Oh, there it is. No, that's not what I wanted, damn it. Cost me triple to paint that. <laughs> that sucks. Oh well. We can get a bunch of performance parts for this thing. I don't know if the crank is one of them, but we'll give it a shot. That's not what we want.
Uh, yeah, I better go back just to make sure that we get the right stuff here. I guess I should both crank down, or both the pistons down. Turn the engine up right. Ryan Dodger liked the stream. Hey Ryan, what's going on? Oh, need a crankshaft pulley. Marvin Martin liked the stream. Hey Marvin, thank you for the like, appreciate that. Ryan Dodger sent 100 stars. Is Rish coming on tonight? I don't know. I don't think so. I haven't uh, heard from him. Thank you for the stars, though. Appreciate that. Performance coil. 
Yeah, unfortunately that doesn't work here. <laughs> Two heads here. go through these so I'll buy a few of them. I think that's it for now. Oh crap. Deleted it off the list. that oh the coil that's what it was See if we can get performance manifolds too. Let's see. Yep. Okay, we can let go of that list. don't think we can get that performance, but let me check it out, just in case. No, that's regular.
you can get custom push or performance push rods too. So let's try that. No. used parts, some bitch. Deborah Beast and Rice liked the stream. Hey Deborah, welcome in. Thank you for the like, appreciate that. Pat Thurston liked the stream. Hey, what's up, brother? Thanks, thanks for coming in. Thank you for the like. I'm building a unicorn Mustang. I don't know if you know what that car is. Well, it's a bad mother. Oh, we can get a performance one of those. That's right. I don't, don't want to use that one. Might as well work this side. No, this is the Hoonicorn Mustang. I haven't uh, done anything with the body yet, but the body was in really good shape. It was so dirty, though, you couldn't, you couldn't see the paint job. But it does need some body work. But it looked a whole lot better after I washed it. Basically a 1,400 horsepower all-wheel drive Mustang, 66, I believe, it's the body style. Let's see. The rocker arms are not performance. The intake is. So are the wires. Oh, I did. I did look at the right wires. All right.
yeah. It's a, uh, it's a drift car though. It was uh, kind of a specialty built by Hoonigan. David Villa liked the stream. Hey David, what's going on brother? Thanks for the like, welcome in. So how's everybody Sunday? I haven't really done a damn thing other than play video games today. <laughs> Performance carburetor. What's going on, David? I almost forgot that damn clip B that I always forget. Well, let me start the car, but won't let me drive it without those clips. <laughs> Probably an air cleaner, but we'll have to get that in a minute. that back off make, make sure there's not a performance option there option there. Okay. Uh, no, it's nothing like NASCAR. It's more drifting. Um, uh, if you, uh, if you Google Jim Connor, you'll basically see this this car in action. Let's see. Make sure there's nothing else I need to add here. Katie Jankola liked the stream. Hey, Katie. Thank you for the like. Appreciate that. Welcome in. Oh, that's right. I need the belts.
Did it let me fix the belts? Oh, sweet, it did. Oh, didn't let me fix that one. All right. It's like rally cross, but uh, but on dirt and asphalt and a bunch of other stuff. Um, don't really know how to describe it. Did I not pick the belt? Guess not. Generally not track based, no. Looks like our engine's complete, so... Anyway, here's the car. It's a wild, it's a wild son of a bitch. Andrew Jacobs liked the stream. Hey, what's up? What's up, Andrew? Okay, so... Guess we can start taking body panels off of it. Because we got to fix all this stuff, too. Come on. Oh, yeah, oh, we're missing the one on this side. All right. Are you still here? Ah, oh, sweet. mean to get in the car I was meaning to take the parts off of the car all right 
So go back in here and see what parts of the body we can fix. Looks like that is it. Go reassemble what we can here. Wait, you didn't let me fix the door? What the hell? That's going to come back off. Let me fix the glass either. Okay. Gotta get a right tail light. Is there no backlash to go in this thing? Maybe not. That we gotta get. parts we need.
couldn't get a new one of those. So. Still gotta replace that door. What the heck? I Ralph Fairman liked the stream. Hey Ralph, thank you for the like. What's going on? Same old, same old? Yeah. I'm doing all right. Let's see. So now, got the body all back together. There's nothing to, more to do to the body, I don't think. Patly liked the stream. Hey, what's up, brother? Welcome in. See, we've rebuilt the motor and put all the necessary body parts on. Oh, I forgot to uh, fix the frame. That's right. Still got to do that. So now we're on reassembly mode here. Where's the welder? There it is. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, you didn't get one of the jobs in Commerce City? Uh, oh, well. What is it? Were you looking at First Transit? Well, this one says 845, I think. I've already built the motor, so let me see if it just gives me the stock numbers here. Oh, 1,400 horsepower. <laughs> I don't know if that's because I've already done all the build, all fleet maintenance job at STI. Oh, yeah, this one's all-wheel drive. Uh, we'll see when we get it on the dyno with the. Uh, yes, he was. Yeah, this was another one of those. Another one of those streams that uh, got out of control. But uh, that's about all I'm going to say about that. 
Uh, this really is the place to talk about that. It was, uh, basically like the New Year's thing. doing wrong here I'm trying to assemble shit Ah, oh, damn it. I didn't want to do that. Need some more of those bushings. Yeah, it was pretty much on par with that, unfortunately, but it is what it is. But Like I said, not really the place to talk about it. Bulletproof transfer case? Uh, yeah. Let's see. Yeah, there's a lot. There's a lot to go back on here. Let's see. Yeah, he's still a good. He's still a good guy. I don't really think it's necessary to talk about that in public. That's kind of a... It's not the way to go about things. No tune transmission. That's weird. go through these, so I'll buy a bunch of them.
Oh good, we did fix it, at least. Fix the fuel tank, but guess not. I did see the fuel pump, so it did fix the fuel pump, but it's weird that it didn't fix the tank. battery too. Should buy a bunch of those too. Ready for wheels and tires yet? Still got to work on that. How's the differential? That's what I'm wondering. That's one thing I haven't seen on this car. Yeah, I haven't seen either one of them, so it's a good question. See the CV shafts. See, nothing to assemble there. I don't know if that's one of those car part B kind of things or, or something. I don't know.
Oh, well. Apparently, there it is. It's part of the body, I guess. So it got fixed with the welding the body. Let's. What about the front? Oh yeah, there's the there's the front diff right there. Huh. Part of the suspension, but no transfer case. Those we gotta buy. I wonder if I can take them apart and fix them. I don't. I don't know though. I wasn't really paying attention when I was repairing all the parts, but I hadn't bought any shock, abs shock absorber assemblies, and the rears were good. Unless those were the ones I built the other day, possibly. <laughs> I did have extras. That's right. So that probably is. Now that I think about it. That's probably exactly what happened. sway bar too. Hey Dwayne, what's going on? Accessible from the top. Accessible from the top. There we go. 
It's been pretty nice today. It was 60, I think, today. That was a bit windy, but I'll take windy over snow. Dwayne Russellberg liked the stream. Hey, thanks for the like, Dwayne. Appreciate that. Okay, so now... I wonder if you can buy... No, you keep that shit up there, man. Make sure that gasket stays good, too, man. Would it be body tuning that you could uh, do performance suspension? Just out of curiosity. are delayed pretty badly. Let's see. Aren't any suspension tunes? Yeah, I was wondering about that. Ah, crap. doesn't say front or rear okay we need two of those we need springs as well front spring okay Got to do the caps to make to make the, the to complete the front springs, right? Lashus Plasher liked the stream. Hey, thanks for the like, Lasher. Appreciate that. Let's see, we need a battery. Yeah, caps. That's what I thought. Guess I might as well buy a few of these. They're all the same. Oh, look at that money go down. Down to 86 grand. I guess I should sell something. <laughs> I have a bad habit of building these custom cars and not selling anything. That's right, I gotta put them together. buy one cap? Shit.
Oh, I bought rears, that's why. Okay. Oh yeah, it's a... Uh, it's the... Um, it's the end game, Daytona. I actually bought the the Charger uh, car mod, so I can actually build a real one, but I had already bought this car before I did that. So that'll be the next car I build. may have to sell something before I build anything else. <laughs> Display car simulator on sandbox. Or did I buy any of these? No, I did not. Okay, so now Oh boy, it's getting close to seven o'clock. Two ninety five thirty eighteen. Do me a favor, type that in the chat. <laughs> I got the same problem remembering these numbers as you do. Four of them are the same size, which is convenient. I'm going to go see if I can fix the rims. I don't know if you can do that or not. It's worth a shot, though. But that would be parts. Okay.
sweet. That saves a whole lot of money. Oh, wrong way. Helps if I buy the damn tires, doesn't it? What, uh, what kind of tire was that? A sport tire? I don't know. Let's see what kind of a tire it was here. Oh, standard tire? That. Nah. Eh, wrong. cool on that. I probably want something that's good for drifting, but I'm not exact so slicks wouldn't be good for that. I can sport tire maybe or race tire. Got gold rims. Go with these. Or eighteens. That was two ninety five thirty eighteen. Want race tires for for drifting? Yeah, yeah, I think so too. Played too much Need for Speed.
Well, good thing it doesn't let you screw that up. Alright. Now. Nothing like mounting the shit from the rear, isn't it? Forgot about the fuel tank. Let's see, will it let me see the fuel pump? That's all we can do from underneath. <laughs> uh, Linda's still playing. Playing fork knife. Guess we can let it all the way down. Shouldn't be anything else to do under underneath it. Yep. Just put the mule tank in here. Uh, did not put the radiator back in, so we need to do that. That's not what I want to do. I don't want to put the clamshell on. Fuck, probably going to have to take the bumper back off. Shit. Oh, there we go. No, oh, damn it. Oh, that's why I didn't click on it. I probably didn't need to take the front end back apart, but oh well. Oh, well, I need one of those. What about the power steering reservoir? Yeah, need one of those too.
don't forget to put the bushings back in the front uh, cross member. I was thinking it wasn't going to let me see it <laughs> without backing up or backing off anyway. Yeah, I did get clip B put in there this time though. I made sure of that. Still got to put uh, fluids in it. Oh, seriously, it's not going to let me get to the cooling. Oh, we're going to take that off to get to that, I think. Where's the brakes? Oh, there it is. hiding up at the front where it never normally is. Hey, is this the cheap shit you keep upstairs, Pat? Sure does look like it. Alrighty, let's 
Let's look and see where we're at here. Parts 98%. What am I missing? It's been back ordered since 1997. <laughs> uh, let's see here. Oh, wait, oh crap, I messed what that was. Front differential. Hmm. Didn't know that it was removable. Let's see here. Oh, crap, I got to take all this crap back apart. <laughs> Shit. Well, some bitch. Oh, maybe not. That's not that bad. shift okay Well, at least it was easy.
look at now. Let's look at it. Ninety-eight percent. What else am I missing? Move it outside so we can do the body or the interior parts. I guess we could just take the door off. Can't, I don't know if you can uh, fix interior stuff, can you? I'll give it a shot. See if, see if anything works here.
I'll make a nice tidy profit of it. Seventy-three thousand dollars. Ninety-eight percent. What the heck is I missing on the parts? Oh, the battery in the starter. Eh, duh. Batteries in the back in this thing. Now it should be at 100%. Ninety-nine. What the hell? ECU. Sure, that's going to be under the hood. Right beside the fuse box, I didn't see a fuse box for this thing. Apparently 
it's not a tunable ECU. I don't think, anyway. Ah, damn it. But it was good. What the hell? Okay, well now it's at 100%. But I don't know why the ECU being at 100% wasn't good enough. That's weird. Now we're at a hundred percent. All right, now Oh, yeah, I know. Yeah, let's do that. So I've never looked at any of this stuff on the walls to see if it does anything. Oh, it's toolbox. Okay. Here we go. This is what I was talking about last night. That's that's about as optimal as you can get. You see? Ryan Dodger sent 100 stars. Nomad, you've been going two hours strong. You're a professional man. Wow. Thank you, Roger. Or, Ryan. Sorry, Roger. Blah tripping over my tongue here appreciate the stars yeah pat this is what i was talking about you see how all three are green yeah the the one in the center is not the same as the others but that's as optimal as it gets okay now I was surprised there was there was not a tunable gearbox for this thing. Oh, well.
But wouldn't that be a bitch if you actually had to take turbos and, and, and take off to put oil in a car? Oh, 1400 factory power. Let's see what we get. horsepower oh my god 1749 pound feet of torque holy shit oh you know where we're going now faster than it was before. gearbox I don't understand that can't drift it right either. Stop this thing. Stop. Maybe I was looking in the wrong place. Would have been in the tune up section, even, or would it still been under gearbox? Because it went that fast before I even did anything to it.
Well, that's what I thought. Gosh, V8 OHV, you would think there would be a tunable gearbox for it. Oh, I must have been looking in the wrong section. All right, well. Okay, let's see here. <laughs> 521 miles an hour, you think it'll go that fast? Let's find out. Oh, I probably should do it in line before uh, I try to do that. Let's see here. Move it to mock speed of Jesus. <laughs>
We're going for the bent suit. 303 is the fastest we're going to get. I could tune in some more. Though. Gravitron, <laughs> right? Now, all that's left to do is to paint it and see much how much money we can sell this thing for. All right, so now. Oh, yeah. Let's see here. That is the classic one. All right. That's the one we just had on there. Oh, I like that one. It goes well with the wheels, too. What do y'all think? Which livery should we put on it? Wonder if it changes with the
looks pretty cool in that. I think this one. Yeah. We'll do the metallic. The stripes stand out better on on that. Plus, I like the kill all tires on it. <laughs> yep, yeah. that's the ticket. Oh, check it out. It even painted the nose cones on the turbos. They were blue. All right, now, what's it worth now? Ooh, $89,000 profit, $145,000. Not bad, not bad. Yeah, I definitely got to sell some cars now. I'm down into seventy-seven thousand dollars. I ain't gonna be able to do much with that. <laughs> yeah. Should I keep it or should I sell it? Or should I sell one of my other cars? Let's see what else we got here. Oh, I guess all I got is Salem. Where the hell is uh, Impala? I still had that. I might have to go search in my shop for that. I think three. Where the hell my Impala is, I don't know. If I remember correctly, this one's worth about 90 grand. But so was the Impala. I gotta find where that Impala is, though. Because I had had it, I built it uh, a couple of streams ago, so it was, it's somewhere. I just don't know where. And maybe it was sitting here and I moved, I moved this car out here and probably yeeted it somewhere else. Let's see. Well, there it is. Yeah, it must have been sitting in spot number one. Yeah. 
Yeah, eighty-seven thousand dollars for this one. Eighty-nine thousand dollars for the orange Mustang. And a hundred forty-five thousand for the unicorn I just built. I would, uh, I would have millions of dollars. What car you got? There's no Pat sitting on a McLaren that's what five million dollars or something like that. Didn't you sell the? Or did you ever sell that Batmobile that was worth eighteen million? I don't know if you sold it or if you parked it. Twenty million. <laughs> Some bitch. Oh yeah, that's right. Your profit was eighteen million. You paid two million dollars for it, didn't you? Oh, you parked the Batmobile? Yeah. I wonder, can you do screenshots on this like you do on ATS? I wonder. Thing is definitely badass though. The garage is full of cars, three Lamborghinis, four Bugattis, and others. Oh yeah, and I've got the I've got those mods. I just clearly don't have the money to buy any of them yet. I need to get that uh, Wii mod put on my computer so I can. Uh, so I can rob a bank, <laughs> basically. All right. Well, this is cool, but it's been sitting in the garage and it's not a real Ford. So, maybe we'll sell this one. I forget. I think the top speed on this one was 274. I'm thinking I should drag race the unicorn before I sell it, so I'll sell this one. This is the next build car. That's what we're gonna build. It's not a. It's the in-game car. It's not the the real Superbird, which you can build. I have the mod for it, but I had this car before I uh, got the mod. I sold the Cadillac too. 
So, 254, that ain't bad. I can do something with that. So I don't have to sell this one yet. I think I might already be in a profit in this one. Yeah. All I did was wash it. I've got $3,400 profit and I can sell it the way it is. If I remember correctly, it's a running car too. Oh, this is how you get this is how you get in the car when it's on the lift. Take the door off. Oh yeah, it does run. Out of curiosity, we'll, f we'll fix the frame, see how much that increases the value. Oh yeah, it gained just a couple thousand dollars. Or did it? Was it 3500 that it was ahead? I don't remember. The fact that it's a complete car helps quite a bit. So, it should be pretty cheap to fix it. Because I should be able to repair most of it. Is Linda pl still playing Fortnite? Do you want to watch um, House of the Dragon? Or should I continue to mess with this? It's up to you, either way. Only have to buy Windows? Yeah. At least you don't have to fix the wing because that's part of the main body structure. Oh, Oklahoma car. I just now noticed that. She's still playing. <coughs> All right. Need to go water the tires real quick. I'll be right back. Hang on.
Alright, I'm back. <clears throat> uh, changing the plates will help the value. Take the Oklahoma plates off of it. <laughs> Oh, I know, because his plates are rusty. So I think I cleaned the interior. Yeah, it looks like it. Shit. Oh, didn't repair the headlight.
Oh wait. So how did you do the custom plate? I already have these in inventory, so I don't know if I have to buy another one to customize it or what. I gotta do it when you buy it. Alright, I just put regular plates on it. the section. be body tuning maybe oh yeah there we go
know. See what it's worth. Oh, there we go. We've got an eleven thousand dollar profit now. So I made six grand, but the question is, is what did I spend on all those parts? A couple grand maybe. Well, at least we know how much that one's worth. Be worth more if I did interior. Yeah. Yeah, I imagine I probably spent about $2,000 on the parts and increased the value by close to six. Hey Jackson, what's going on, man? Jackson Davis liked the stream. Hey, thanks for the like. Oh, we got some cool cars here. Got a NASCAR, got a 70 Mustang, 69 Mustang, 71 Roadrunner. Ooh, two stars. That can't be, that can't be good. It is a race car, though. I was missing a whole lot, though. Oh, the engine's all there. Wonder if it runs. Probably not. thousand dollar bone shaker oh yeah no steering wheel there's no oil in the engine of course there is Basically got a tub there. <laughs> Which of there's no engine in it either. Well, part of one. Yeah, no royal in the scrapyard. Well, not necessarily true. The that hun that unicorn was a uh, was a. Uh, uh, in this auction and it ran looked like shit but it ran it was a complete running car but I think it was four star though oh well, yeah that's what a two thousand dollar bone shaker looks like <laughs> Skull's in good shape, though. Can't get in it because there's no seats in it. This 
see what else we got. Oh, Hudson Hornet. Oh, that looks pretty complete there. Oh, except for the engine. Cool car though. Yeah, it won't start. It's pretty wore out. Klondike. Is that Canadian? Yep, looks like a trunk. Look at this thing. The truck is mafia approved. <laughs> yeah. I don't think you can do that. You have to buy the parts and fix them up. This looks cool. Oh yeah, that's right. It's Australian's right-hand drive. start? No, of course not. It's a cool car though. I like it. Oh yeah, dismantle both. It does look like it's uh, 
A supercharged LS, maybe? Now, whatever it is, it is supercharged. Definitely worn out. What do you guys think? Should I bid on this thing? Or should we look at what else is out there? You guys pick what you want to see next. Let's give it a go. You would guess it's unique, yeah, that's what I was thinking too. Let's see what else is out there. Well, I gotta see how bad this Corvette is. Oh, yeah, that's one star. <laughs> Engine looks good though. Should be able to, yeah. Yeah, no oil in the engine, of course. That's not that bad considering it's one star. I wonder how bad the engine is. New Corvette's uh, engine is in the back. They're now a mid engine car. There's the fuel tanks.
surprisingly, the engine's not that bad. It's mostly external shit that's wrong with it. That's not that bad for a one-star car. I'm curious about this NASCAR. How bad this thing is. Oh yeah. <laughs> Nobody. Can't even get in it. There's got to be a way in. Just got to figure it out. Nothing left of the motor either, other than the block. Yep, no pistons or nothing. Let's give this one a shot. Shit, Russia's busting my balls on this thing. $34,000. Oh, you gotta buy pistons anyway? Yeah, because it's performance parts. Yeah, he does. See if your car is in here. Damn, I should have bit harder on that uh, Auburn boat tail because it was in here the first time I went in here. And I'll probably never see it again either. <laughs> Oh, 
Calm down, Rush. <laughs> yeah. Well, let's see if it runs. I forget. Gotta put oil in it. Where's the oil? Okay, there it is. God damn it. It's right hand drive still. <laughs> Put a steering wheel in it and see if it drives. Oops. steering wheel. Brake fluid missing. Okay. Huh. Interesting. Might as well check the rest of the fluid. That's oh, got oil in it. It's got coolant in it. Brake fluid.
coolant fluid missing it had some in it maybe not enough Son of a bitch. <laughs> well, at least the coolant will be clean. Shit, we're gonna have to drive on the outside of this thing. You can't see nothing. That's got some balls. sent 100 stars. Nomad, where is re SH stream? I have no idea, man. I've been playing a game. I haven't heard from him. Thanks for the stars. I don't know. He's sleeping. I sent him a message earlier. He never did reply. I guess, yeah. See if this thing's got any paint on it or not. Looks like it might, but we'll see. Oh, yeah. It's not too bad. Considering it's probably from the 50s, or a 50s car that was rebuilt in the 90s, I would say.
Oh, the interior looks a lot better. It's pretty cool. I like it. Oh, I meant to set that outside. So that must mean the hood accordance in the wash bay. Yeah. Oh, that thing looks badass, doesn't it? that car in parking. Well, let's see, before we do anything to it, let's see what the value of, of it is. See if we're profiting yet. Hey, not bad. Washed it, got a fifteen hundred dollar profit. That's good. Both of these cars were in the green before I even messed with them. was actually the frame this time so all of this body comes off which means it's going to be expensive to fix it let's see that's what the, the back of the body should look after the welder so that means all those all those body panels are removable including the roof and the quarters oh yep But the cool thing about that is that means I might be able to repair all that. Alrighty guys, I think this is where I'm going to end it. I appreciate y'all hanging out. Glad you enjoyed the unicorn build. And uh, kind of an homage to Ken Block, who's no longer with us. So that's part of the reason I didn't want to sell it either. I hang on to that for a bit. But anyway, thanks for being awesome. Yeah, put some GGs in the chat if you would. Keep the shiny side up and the rubber side down, and be kind to those around you. Well, we'll catch you all later. Good night now. Whoops. I doubt there's anyone to raid, but I'll look. Oh, Big Jim's uh, 
Big Jim's playing Red Dead Redemption. Let me send you over there. We'll do that. 